to go as far as to find somebody's husband and try to dox them. For y'all to go as far as to pull up somebody's kids and, and shame their children. Trifling. Disgusting. A lot of y'all are the very people that just the girl is talking about. Yep. It's giving convicted. Get out there. That nigga is get out there. Imagine calling somebody out for claiming that they talk bad about black women just for the same person to go back around and talk horribly about another black woman. A lot of y'all are hypocrites and it shows. And then for y'all talking about some, oh, her delivery is messed up, her delivery is messed up. Did y'all care about y'all delivery when y'all were criticizing the hell out of her? Got him. We fucking got him. <laughs> I didn't think so. A lot of y'all want to be able to do whatever the hell you want with nobody to say nothing. But in the same breath, when somebody wants to say something about it, now you got a problem with that. It's the blatant hypocrisy. You gotta go and find this woman's husband and her kids and y'all don't know what she got going on in her life. Y'all are some of the low down, trifling people that she is talking about. A hundred percent. And I just know when she pops on your FYP, you get a, you, you, you can't help yourself, can you? Please seek help. Expeditiously. If Jesus can't save these hoes, why are you trying? What make you think you greater than Jesus, nigga? What's going on? Welcome back to another one. Don't forget, hit that like, subscribe, tickle that notification bell. That will let you know every time I upload content, you know what we're gonna do. Yep. Roll that clip. My clients are the same women who blame men for everything. Facts. No accountability. That's what it is. If you do not like my content, you don't like accountability. Yep. You don't. Because it's coming from a place of we got to do better for too long. Black women hear me. This is this message is right here is for you. We have allowed black men to be the forefront of everything. They had to take the heat for everything. Yep. It was all the black man's problem. They left. They, they're the worst fathers. They left the women. They're cheaters. They're liars. They, they rolled that out for a long time. But recently we've been exposed. Black women have been exposed. It's over 9,000! What 9,000? They've exposed us to say, hold up now, wait a minute. Something ain't right. It ain't just them them black men. Black men have said, no, it was, it was the black woman. Hey, yeah. The black woman is the one who has been abusing the children. Hey, the black yeah. woman has been the one who is also abusive to the man. The black woman is the one who kids don't want to be around their mother, hey, yeah. right? And because now we have been exposed and, uh, and someone is calling us out on our behaviors, we don't like it. And there's women of other races who don't like my content either. And they also don't like accountability. If you are used to blaming men or blaming someone else for everything that goes wrong in your life, that's why you don't like it. You don't want to see that we all have choices. You played the role in that, you made a choice, and that was a consequence. We don't like that. I stay far away from women who don't like accountability. That's just me personally. And I think all women should stay away from people in general who don't like accountability because people in general who don't like accountability are a dangerous group of people. I want all two of y'all watching, ladies. Take accountability. It's all right. It's okay. It's not going to hurt that you take just a little bit of accountability. The reason why you hate this woman is because she, like all the other women that are pygmies, pygmesians, they just hold you accountable. Instead of you blaming men, why don't you look in the mirror and look at what you did to get in the situation that you're in? Come on now, dog. Accountability is a two-way street, but only one is being talked about, and that's men. We constantly talk about men, but we never talk about women. We never talk about how women are doing this, women are doing that, women are messing up, women are 
making themselves look bad. I told you. What did I tell you? But when you look at accountability, it's only going toward the men. But as soon as a woman, as soon as anybody says anything about anyone, it's an issue. Why? Because you hate accountability. And I'm so glad this woman touched on that. She's breaking down the systematic thought process of what's really going on with women. Modesty is not for men. Let's be honest. OnlyFans ladies, women that post half naked on Instagram and Twitter, you're doing it for men. Men are your primary audience. So when you're dressing like a 304 God, hey! or a skank, or you're dressing half scantily clad, we know what you're doing. We know who you're doing it for. And women have the nerve to say, I'm not doing it for a man. Yes, you are. We know. So if you're a woman dressing like a 304, trying to get male attention, and you really think the world is going to take you seriously, they're not. They're going to treat you how you present yourself. However you present yourself to the world is how the world is going to treat you. Anyway, y'all, that's been it for today's video. Don't forget, hit that like, subscribe, tickle that notification bell that will let you know every time I upload content. And until the next video, peace. I'm here to tell you right now, we don't care. Let me tell you, right, let me tell you <laughs> We don't care. Jerry.